uh, okay I thought it will be fun to show you the panning gauge but the way of showing panning gauge will be very different now so there will be a practical example so I have opened an advert gauge and you can see what is inside so the panning gauge is used to measure very very low pressure I mean uh, it can measure up to 10 to the minus 2 millibar to 10 to the minus 7 millibar it's also called cold death hose gaze uh, so uh, what is happening here is if you see there is a uh, there is a cathode which is uh, you apply very very high uh, voltage and there is an anode uh, uh, so when you and these uh, these pieces are inside a ma uh, permanent magnet so when you apply a very high voltage what is happen there will be a, some gas molecule so the discharge will happen uh, so uh, the discharge will happen and then uh, uh, and the electrons because of the let's say let's say it was argon argon becomes argon positive and electron electron will be accelerated toward anode and it will and then it is connected to emitter and the way you can measure the current uh, so the when the you have a large number of molecules you have a um, uh, this, I mean, you have a bad pressure large number of molecules that mean more discharge uh, more ions that mean more current so so at uh, at higher uh, uh, at higher i mean very bad vacuum at higher pressure you'll have a large amount of current that's why it is not recommended to use this gauge at uh, uh, higher uh, pressure always uh, recommended to use below minus 2 millibar that's how the curve look like current versus pressure now let's see what is inside okay so i have opened a uh, uh, edward panning gauge uh, okay so this is just this part is the permanent magnet and there is uh, and there is a provision to read it read the uh, current and uh, apply the voltage whatever so uh, what you are seeing here is uh, uh, this part which is anode and the, the, the this part which is cathode uh, which goes inside uh, uh, so uh, so this is anode you and and it's insulated and this part is cathode or the body is touched with the body so it body so this body is cathode uh, so this o-ring makes sure that in the design in such a way that it is leak tight from the back side uh, you can tighten and it will be leak tight from the uh, from the back side uh, so uh, so the very high acceleration voltage is applied between this body and the anode uh, so there will be um, this body and the anode and there will be discharge and uh, this guy is uh, connected to the uh, end point of which I'm not able to show you but okay is which uh, which somehow act as a act to act as to measure the current that's all so this goes inside this and this guy can be fitted inside thank you